Hi guys, so you know it's 2020, Happy New Year by the way, and a lot of you guys are transitioning to vegan diets, but even if you're not becoming vegan, I know this is just the year and the time of year that a lot of people just want to be healthier, take better care of yourself, focus on wellness, working out, eating right, all these things. This video is sponsored by JCPenney. They invited me to come into the store and shop for some of my favorite wellness products and just wellness products that I think will help me in my 2020 goals of having more time to myself, taking more baths, and just being a little bit more centered as a new mom. Now this is a two part video. The first part is me gonna be shopping and you're gonna come along with me. But the second part is actually gonna be on JCPenney's YouTube channel. And you can go over there to watch the haul and to see in detail everything that I buy today. Before we actually start shopping, we need to head into the Sephora inside of JCPenney so that I can get a little foundation and I'll feel even more um, well about my skin. My skin looks pretty good, but you know when I'm on camera, I like to have a little foundation on. Okay, so let's get started. Okay, so I got my makeup done. I feel so much better. We're gonna head upstairs and we're gonna check out, first of all, the kitchen stuff that they have. In my opinion, the number one way you start your wellness journey is by eating better, putting better things into your body. So you have to have good kitchenware to actually cook the healthier, more delicious food. So we're gonna check out what they have up here in their kitchen department. Okay, so the first thing I see that I definitely wanna get is one of these Himalayan salt lamps. If you guys have watched my nighttime routine video, you know that I have to do basically everything in the kitchen because I don't want to make too much noise in the bathroom because my daughter is sleeping in the bedroom, which is right next to the bathroom. And if I take a bath in there, then I put like a ton of little tiny LED candles. I think it would really be cool to have one of these Himalayan salt lamps because they're supposed to be antimicrobial. Soothing glow, which is true. I really just like it because it looks pretty and it's relaxing. So I think I'm gonna get one of these. Oh, one of these. Okay, these silicone baking mats, mine look terrible. They're, they're like really old. These are really good because when you bake, basically stuff doesn't stick to them. And also you can use less oil or no oil at all, which is really nice. It's really horrible when you do a bunch of meal prep and then at the end you realize that you don't have enough containers for everything. So, some more containers would be good. I also like these because I like to take my food on the go with me when I leave the house. That way I don't eat out as much, you know? Okay, so mixing bowls are really important because you want to eat more salads, right? So I'm gonna get some of these. Whatever type of mixing bowls you get, it really doesn't matter. Stainless steel tends to be good just because it doesn't hold any odors, it's easy to clean, you don't have to worry about it falling and breaking like with glass. And it's eco-friendly, of course, so. Okay, and here's the thing about blenders. You gotta make sure you have a nice blender if you wanna make nice and creamy soups and smoothies in the easiest way. So there's a lot of different ones. Nutribullet, I've had that before. Ninja, I bought this for my mom. They're both really good. I like the Ninja also though because it comes with a food processing attachment that you can put on top. Those combos are pretty cool. They also save counter space. Okay, let's talk pots and pans really quickly. My friend and I were just talking about the green pan. This is a brand that makes these non-stick pots and pans, but the non-stick is not just Teflon, so you don't have to worry about toxic chemicals into your food. The whole point of getting a non-stick pan would be to cut down on using so much oil when I'm cooking. Max and I have been talking about using a little bit less, so these are good options because you can actually saute without using any oil at all. You can also do that with regular pans and just put some water or vegetable broth or wine. I think I'm gonna try one of these because I've heard such good things about them, so. Turquoise, shall we? I like this one. Pretty color. You know I already have two instant pots, so I'm not gonna be silly and buy a third one. 
but I just wanted to show it to you guys because when it comes to wellness, eating better, taking care of yourself, a lot of people say they don't have time to cook, blah, blah, blah. You need to make time, one, but also just make it easier for yourself to not make those excuses. So the Instant Pot is really great because you can put stuff in there, walk away, forget about it, and very quickly it's finished. I use my Instant Pot at least once a day and they have a good sale on it right now. Buy one, get one 50% off. Tinted, but I already have two, so. Okay, so I'm seeing all these air fryers. My mom just got herself one for Christmas. I've kind of gone back and forth with air fryers. I like them a lot because you don't have to use a lot of oil when you cook with them, but they're also really large, and I have a really small apartment, so. Oh, and Ninja has one, look at this one. Looks really nice. Look at the fries like pouring out of the top of it. Like that's what everybody wants. A bunch of french fries for me, sweet potato fries. You can air fry, you can roast, you can reheat, you can dehydrate. To see like everything, all the details of what I'm buying today, watch the other video on JCPenney's channel. I'm gonna link it down below so you can go and see, and I'll talk more in detail about why I chose what I chose, okay? So I have all my goodies. I'm gonna take them home and I'm going to record myself showing you everything when I got and talking about why I got it and how it's gonna help me with my 2020 wellness goals. So in order to see that video, head over to the JCPenney channel. I'm gonna link it down below. So just click through right now, check it out. And I'm very excited to use all of these goodies. If you haven't already subscribed to my channel, Sweet Potato Soul, make sure you subscribe right now and hit the notification button. And of course, leave a comment down below. Let me know what you guys are planning on doing and what your goals are for 2020 and how you are planning to achieve them. So thanks guys so much for watching. I'll see you in the next video right now. See you. <laughs>